forward, and then back, forward and back. Good afternoon everybody, this is forward and back. Off we go, on the wheel, out and about. Look, here we are today at Manly. This place is called Manly. What have we got happening today? We've got some new shoes, new boots on. These could be the best boots for electric unicycle that I've ever tried. We'll find out. So there's uh, some new Alpine Star kicks. They've got really good heel support. They're casual, comfortable. Look at that grip. Plus, stylish. They've got a little bit of that black and red King Song color going for them and that's good because the King Song's not far off. Also put some shred lights on. Got some one of the thousand on my helmet. I'll come up here. I've got the yeah the thousand on my helmet just on a flash setting to let people know that I'm coming. And I put the couple just underneath the pedals but I put the wrong colours so I, I, so I was supposed to put two reds and um, I've put, yeah, a, a clear and a red. So that looks good, interesting. And I just wanted to get out for a little bit and say hello, we've got a lot of rain coming. So yeah, before the rain came, I thought I'd come along and say hello to you all again, get some footage, get out on the wheel and yeah, chat. Just so I miss you all. These shoes have got a really good amount of grip on them, hey? So this is, um, yeah, this is the, the Redlands, Morton Bay, they call this. I guess the tide's out and no one's around because it's cold. So I've got this place to myself. A good afternoon. I hope everybody's well out there. Everyone's starting to get new wheels. I've seen them delivered big boxes of shiny wheels getting to everybody. Uh, mine's not too far away, I think. I thought I saw a shark dolphin, crocodile, eagle. That's a King Song eagle right there. Yep, yeah, my V11, I made it black again. I got sick of all the big, vibrant, bright colors. A little bit of black plastic tape. That orange, it's disgusting. After a while, you know, things, things become a bit plain. Plain Jane, if they're the same all the time. I think it shows, um, this is definitely my beat em up wheel, isn't it? I like to put this one through its paces and it cops a bit of a trashing. I like it, it's character. Do what you do to just be you, and that's cool. This is nice, isn't it? There's trees, people playing on the park. We'll go along a little bit. All the kids are just playing at the park, so I thought I'd grab a quick five minutes to zip around the pathways. But there's lots of kids, so we'll take it easy. And yeah, I'm just getting my knee back into things. It's a bit, um, still feels a little bit weak and a little bit wobbly, so a good way to get that, um, get that a bit of a workout, I think, is to just get it leaning. You know, do a few of those little snaky snakes on the wheel. It's a big puppy. See little jumps. These shoes do feel good though. We'll zip over this way. That's what this um this wheel's good for, you know, on and off the grass. You got people coming up and that suspension still eats up those bumps really well. Yeah, it's so awesome. Cool to be back. Cool to be shooting videos. I just, I miss it and I want to get out all the time making things and yeah, so I'm going to do a bit more of an advanced shred light video. I had to take a bit of time off because my knee was a bit sore. It's really cold here at the moment, getting out at night, yeah, 
and but I will do it. Look, I'm so stoked that Shredlight sent me out some of this kit. I've played around with it, I just haven't put all the footage together. And what I get, you know, I can definitely increase my vision at night, it's great. Plus, it's mostly just about being safe, I think, letting people see you. So that's why, you know, I got this flashing whiz bob up on my helmet. This light is extreme. Uh, two kilometers, they say that it will go for. Now, this is not on the brightest setting, but I have put it on the brightest setting. And let me tell you, it lights up the whole street. I find it's a really versatile torch to just pull on and off. The helmet, also, um, if you use the promo code BACK10, you'll get 10% off shred lights. How is that? That's like worth it. Worth it for subscribing to my channel. So please do that. I think that's an extremely nice thing to shred lights to do. Shout out to you shred lights. And shout out to you if you're watching and if you need some lights. But you know, it's just another way to be seen. Seen and not heard. Lights, camera, action. As soon as we've got the King Song Man, we're gonna jump around. Yeah, jump around like a white man playing basketball. That's what we're gonna do. I've got all these steps and I'm really tempted to drop down them, but my knee's still playing up. The last few days I've got on the wheel, just had a little twist as I'm rolling along and yeah, it just flares up that uh, injury again, doesn't it? So I'm just trying to take it easy. And yeah, this is just a really quick video, just to show you some lights, some new shoes, and get out on the wheel for five minutes. Get some footage before all the rain comes. So really good toe protection, it's a casual boot. But I was just looking for a casual Alpine Stars boot. Something that's comfortable, lightweight, that I can walk around in. I think that's a big part of the electric unicycle world is, you know, you're on it and then you're off it. You're walking at the lights, so you don't just want a fully protective motorcycle boot all the time but you want the protection of a motorcycle boot in a casual shoe, and that's what I looked for. Hadn't seen these one in their range, these, this model in their range before. I can tell you that grip is outstanding on those honeycomb pedals. Um, yeah, there's no movement at all, and really good grip. Uh, I can feel the ankle support. I don't think they've got a fully, fully protected heel ankle but you know they're nice and strong up there the shoelaces they're really tiny and thin i did see one review mention that they couldn't find replacement uh, replacement shoelaces easy because they're really small and elastic and kind of extra long find that they've got these really extra long laces and they're on a quick draw system so you just pull it up and pull the sort of tighten it up it's really quick and easy to do but you do have a bit of excess lace that you can just velcro around so i don't mind that there's a really narrow toe i've got a wide um i've got a wide foot myself so the narrow toe you know, it's a little bit squishy at the first but now i'm used to it i've only been wearing them for about an hour so they'll break in a little bit more but yeah feeling really good casual i'm, I'm planted they're a firm shoe um you know i like something really tight when i'm doing any activity like this it just helps me feel planted and secure and these are a really tight snug fit but I've got that ankle support I've got a bit of toe protection really good grip they're light and yeah they're gonna be a really good shoe I think for shooting around on the unicycle of, um, of wheeling I try a few different shoes and I've got a few different setups that I like to roll around in, depending if I'm heading into the trails or just a casual roll. And try, these I think are gonna be a good mid ground uh, for doing a bit of everything. I can get into the trails on them with a little bit of protection, but I can also quite easily, you know, just go for a walk around town if I need to do that too. A little puppy. So yeah, that's about it for this video, I think. We're just gonna roll back, roll back to the car and go home. I've got all the kids on holiday, so it's a bit nuts at the moment. 
around our house. But yeah, I'm having fun, having fun making these videos, having fun chasing my kids, and having fun chatting to you all in the comments. So, you know, I look forward to whatever you're going to drop and let me know. I just gotta watch out for dogs. I've seen a few people running over dogs lately on their electric wheels. Ah, oh, don't do that. I like dogs. Yeah, so this is sunset. Oh, it's supposed to be sunset. It's not really happening. Not much colour and not much of a... It's a bit of a yucky beach. Sometimes it looks nicer than this. All the mangrovey lava flows. Anyway, all the King songs look good. I think what I've seen dropping, there's not too much changed. Kind of a bit of a disappointment. I think there's still some confusion over people wondering what batteries that they're supposed to receive. You know, E-wheels are getting the 40T cells and it seems everybody else isn't. So th that does cause a little bit of poor taste in some people's mouths. It feels like, you know, what is it, a different wheel that other people are getting? We're not really prone to the best stuff because we're from an inferior country or I'm not too sure how that feels but you know I think it would be nice if all of the dealers got the same options so you know what, what does that make us consider switching our orders from one dealer over to another I don't know if that's in King Song's best interest to make people start to, to feel like that um, all good for the person that gets those those options but you know what about all those other dealers I really would have liked the option of a 40T cell um, and maybe down the line something can be worked out but it, you know I think it would be nice if everybody had that option. I'm Ford and back from Brisbane, Australia, and this is an electric wheel or an EUC, an electric unicycle. Gets me everywhere I need to go, all the time. It's amazing. I can never fault this thing. Even if I try well, I can, but I don't want to because it's, it is, it's truly amazing. The things this thing has done for me, uh, if you've watched my channel or if you haven't, I'm telling you, believe it. You could either get yourself a yacht and sail around the world in luxury or you could get yourself a wheel and roll around the streets in glory it's up to you you can choose how to roll but convenient it's a really convenient transport it's the most convenient transport i've ever had yeah it just fits in the car and i just i pack it in case what i mean in case i pack it because i always know i'm going to use it i tell my wife it's in case just in case it's five minutes absolutely no the whole time and I'm gonna use it for at least five minutes as often as I can because it is that convenient it's not hard to start you don't need to go get petrol you don't need to do much you just make sure you've charged it and then chuck it in the, in the car chuck it in a box chuck it in your locker you can chuck it around wherever you want because it's so convenient and yeah then off you go off you go for adventures. And it's really, really good. So yeah, please stick stick by my channel. Um, yeah. I'm gonna try to keep things exciting and plan a few more videos around the shred lights, the boots. I've got some grizzler pads. I've settled on grizzler pads for for my wheel and uh, for my King Song. And look, I'd like to say they've they've come on board as an affiliate, so that's amazing. So thank you, um, now I've got a few affiliate links on my channel. We've got Clark Pads, Shred Lights, and also Grizzler. Um, and that's amazing, thank you to all of them. If you use those links, there's a slight kickback for me and a bit of a discount for you, but it's all good gear, and it's gear that you can see on the channel. So look, stick by me, stick by the brands that I'm trying to show you are very good. Well, thanks for watching my video. I'll see you next time with another video. This is Ford and Back. Bye for now.